Hello, uh, I am working on the Unity game, so I want to share some experience of the game creation process. And first of all, I want to say that I have a solid background in 3D, and 2D games was new to me, so I want to share some tips and tricks that I was made during um, creation of the game. Um, we have used Unity 4.3 to make 2D games because it has uh, all new cool features for creating 2D games fast and cool. The main cool features is called sprite uh, rendering and uh, importing system when every uh, sprite is covered by the polygons to minimize alpha rendering on the screen. It's like our foreground plane with cave is covered and we do not uh, need to render alpha in this free space. Next I want to say about our main menu. A common um, creation of the menu is to use a and GUI or 2D toolkit or built-in Unity system for uh, UI. What we decided to make it uh, as game objects. <laughs> yeah, it's much more simpler and cooler is for me. For example, when I hit this button, it is interacting with physics and jumping nice. <laughs> so let's play. All games split into scenes so we can easily navigate and build game inside Unity Editor without any restrictions. Here we can see our main hero and a colonist and it is discovering underwater caves. Alright, took a dynamite. Here is an oxygen station. We have a limited oxygen for our hero. I'm gonna place diamond and look for an explosion. Here it is. It was made by um, one object and all the children are parts of these objects. So when a dynamite explodes, I simply destroy parent objects and uh, make visible child children with a rigid body and collider supplied. Guess we need to s discover some oxygen station over here because we don't want to die. Here it is. Bombs are very important parts of the game. We don't need to hit them because we can destroy ourselves. All environment is reacts um, between uh, explosions. You can kill fishes by explode. You can interact with the uh, ropes. By the way, we have used um, ultimate rope for creating ropes. Here's the lever. We can hit them and open some door. Here it is. Yes, I should swim back to pump my oxygen. Okay, nice. We need a dynamite to make this uh, wall explode. I guess I can explode. This is a puzzler game we need to think here. Oh, oh, oh. Let's swim over here and pump our oxygen. You see like it's becoming green. Let's fly. Fly accurate. Swim, not fly. <laughs> Let's take dynamics. By the way, we have no UI in game at all. Like you see, we have taken uh, diamond, and you can see here in his hands some pumping. Thank you. 
We have plays in here and... Oh, <laughs> damn. Physics is a very cool feature of the game and the unit itself. <gasps> oh, we have... We have killed this fish. <laughs> you haven't seen probably, but <laughs> with Siege Harpoon we have killed fish. We need more diamond to kill fish. We're gonna place it here and probably it's gonna kill that fish. Yeah, I was right. Let's take our diamonds and complete the level. Here it is. That's it. Uh, thank you for watching.